All right, we're here in Meriden on our tour of 41 towns in 41 days. Uh, as you can see, uh, we had a little rain today. In fact, it was raining pretty hard when we started uh, here around 4.45 or 5. We're now uh, sort of bordering on 6 o'clock, uh, and uh, luckily the rain has stopped. But uh, rain or shine, we're out knocking doors on every town in this district uh, over the course of uh, this month and a half. Um, we had a good response today. Um, you know, it was nice. We had some overhangs, so we got to shield ourselves from the rain. But the last uh, house that we caught somebody at was uh, Mr. Rona, and it was a really interesting conversation because what he talked about was his utter frustration with the tone of politics in Washington. Um, and he actually said that he had been a Lieberman supporter in part because he liked the fact that Lieberman was, was crossing party aisles, uh, crossing party lines in order to work together on things. And you do hear that a lot. You hear that people have this frustration that Congress, regardless of party, Republican or Democrat, just cares about scoring political points with each other. And they don't care about getting things done. Um, and there's definitely a frustration with the Republicans' direction that they have taken this country in. But there's also a general frustration with just everything that is happening in Washington right now. Um, and that's really what our campaign for change is about. Not just changing the issue direction of the country on health care, on energy, on the environment, but also changing the tone of politics in Washington. And, you know, I use the stem cell bill that uh, I was um, lucky enough to author as an example of that. The, my chief co-sponsors on that stem cell bill that invested $100 million into life-saving stem cell research here in Connecticut were were Republicans. It didn't matter if you were Republican, liberal, you know, Republican, Democrat, liberal, conservative. If you cared about passing stem cell research, if you cared about saving lives, we wanted you in the table. We wanted you in the room at the table. Uh, and that's what I want to bring to Washington. And I think that's what Washington so desperately needs, is to restore that kind of bipartisanship when it comes to issues that matter. You hear this here in 